Good morning, how are you doing? Everybody, I'm a little low because it's kind of kind of late. Good morning. This is Tuesday, uh, April. No, this is Tuesday. My back. This is Tuesday, June the fifteenth. I've been here almost a year. My hair is cut because I have crazy people that stalk me. I have my hair cut. You can check on the difference with Sonia Clinton too on YouTube. Sonia Clinton dash then Sonia Perone on YouTube. So you can check it out on my Facebook account at Sonia Perone. I've had my hair cut because due to my safety concern, they lie about where the chick with a blonde hair. This is me. This is my hair cut. You can check DNA papers and everything else. I've had my hair cut. I've had, I had long hair. I had to cut it due to my safety. They were talking about kidnapping me if I have blonde hair. I had to cancel my research study. I really meant ask why because of my safety. Um, they're doing it for drugs. They're high for drugs. They'll do anything for drug for $2. They used my phone today, pretend to be Social Security office impersonated. They were impersonating Social Security. There was a person named me for a year, trying to get stuff in my name, which I didn't approve of. Um, just want to let you know, I cut my hair due to safety concerns. And I look better with it and without it. I will have red hair. Blonde hair, I was going to have. But due to my safety, I decided to have red hair and brown and red and brown and black only. Because they're not taking their medication, they're schizophrenia, they don't want to take medicine, they don't want to do nothing but make people feel sorry for them. I had to cut my hair permanently because their behavior. Um, here you go, my head operation here. I'll be meeting with the, the nurse today. I've been living here, um, paying, no, nah, not paying, but fuck that shit. To rephrase it, I've been living here in Morrison for almost a year. I like it here. Um, I had an apartment inspection yesterday. My hair is cut short for a year. I've been here for a year. I've been waiting to cash out. I want to have my money in control. That's why they hold it up. They're good con artists. They like to personate Social Security office, federal, city, state, federal. They personate everything on my door. I have people knock on my door looking for them. They owe drug money to the Colombians when I'm hearing in the neighborhood. Hearing it too. Shut up. Um, this one let you know. Um, Clinton. Urban home, Clinton Urban Pathway. I've been here for a year. These women have nothing but obsession thing for me. They hate me 100%. They have lied. They're con artists. They do it. They did all this for a slice of pizza and a, and a, and a glass of soda. The soccer players been doing things for them for a year. They come at me for a year. Long Island City people been telling them to come at me for a year. Queens people. And then you have copycats and all the boroughs that have been telling them to come at me for a year for a couple of dollars, $2, $20. For crack, cocaine, anything. I can't sleep. They still talk to themselves. You can hear it. You know, they, they laugh. They make fun of me. They let the stalk appear on them, eat his shit and feces and all that other dumb shit. I can see it right now. I saw it a couple occasions. So I cut my hair for a different reason because they're too sick around me and they're too mentally deranged. So they hold up the money. They hold the stimulus package because I won't get them a glass of soda, which they didn't want for me. They ain't one of my N and S hands. My N hands, um, Aero, Wing Negro, um, all racist terms is here. Uh, we should stay in the back of the bus and all this nonsense. I cut my hair for safety concerns. I walk for a year. I'm not catering because that's not their attention. They want to control minorities, brown-skinned people with holes, with sluts. That we deserve to get our face taken laughing. He, he, he. I took your ends out of America. America. America, like they talk like they're very ignorant. The very ignorant women <clears throat> in general. They talk shit about me. They try to rephrase it that it's not me, but I know they're talking about me 100%. They think I'm dumb and stupid. I like my hair black and brown and red. You don't like it. That's not your business. That's not your concern. I have my money controlled because you're mentally ill. You're schizophrenia. You're unmedicated. You're un very unmedicated. And I do agree with the men. I really mean I've been living in the Bronx for a long time because of them. I cut my hair for a long time. I did not, I did not let them purchase nothing. I do not have a credit card. I asked for a credit card. I do not have a credit card. My credit is bad. Hand slip. I did not let them purchase none of the stuff from five boroughs, each county, even online. I did not access it. That's no. I cut my hair for safety concerns. That's all I have to say. I did not approve none of that stuff. So I'm, I've am i been here in the Bronx for a long time. I have. You can check my social media account. I'll be emailing it. Have a great day. Good morning. Bye.